The presentation of a specially crafted sword to Donald Trump carries profound symbolism, reflecting military service, patriotism, and a deep reverence for America's heritage. This sword, forged from materials steeped in national history, like the doors from al-Baghdadi's hideout, iron from the Oregon Trail wheel, and wood from trees planted by George Washington, encapsulates the spirit of courage, sacrifice, and the enduring legacy of American values. First off, I'm a veteran of 10 years, and uh, when this happened, it spoke to me in a way that I can't put into words. Uh, when I was asked to be a part of this and make this on behalf of the Abigail Coalition, <clears throat> I knew I had to do something special. So this knife, one of my best friends is the operator that exterminated El Big Dad. Yeah. And this blade is forged with steel from the door that Al Daddy was hiding behind. The black part of the steel in this Samai blade steel directly from that door. The guard is 18th century wrought iron from a wagon wheel that crossed the U.S. on the Oregon Trail. The handle is white oak from the last stone tree that George Washington planted that fell at Mount Vernon at 240 years old. And the backdrop is the actual shirt that the operator wore when he shot Al Daddy in the face. Yeah. It is an absolute honor to present this on behalf of the Abigail Coalition. The involvement of Gold Star families, who have borne the ultimate sacrifice, highlights the nation's commitment to honoring those who have defended its freedom. Their gesture toward Trump underscores a mutual respect for the military and the importance of bolstering national security. It represents a shared understanding of values such as duty, honor, and unwavering commitment to the nation's welfare. Gifting a sword also nods to a conservative tradition that values strong, yet compassionate, leadership. Trump's willingness to connect with these families, grieving alongside them, listening to their stories, and sharing personal moments reveals qualities of leadership that resonate with the public. It suggests that leadership transcends mere policy making, embodying personal connection, empathy, and a deep appreciation for those who have made sacrifices for their country.